Welcome to this, the way of the samurai. Uh, we're going through the fundamentals of the goshi, which is the five uh, fundamentals, but of course there are more than five, as always in uh, old uh, stuff. So let's talk about courtesy. Right, courtesy. So here we've got, from the Theosaurus, we've got good manners, civility, um, good breeding, cordiality, geniality, refined, diplomatic. So let's try and backtrack a bit. Um, the way is, you know, following the way of the universe. Virtue is high moral behaviour. Benevolence is well-meaning kindness. Righteousness is to have no guilt, to be innocent inside. Uh, but courtesy is your interaction with others. So there's a little bit of a crossover here between benevolence and courtesy because both of those imply interacting with other people. So, for example, having good manners. So you may be innocent inside, but do you have the correct social manners? Do you, do you have the correct social manners for the people around you? And how do you, how do you interact with the crowd or with people? Are you diplomatic? Like, oh, okay, you know, let's work through this. Or are you just an idiot? You're like, rah, 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 rah. Do you have the diplomatic skills to, to push through a situation in a cordial way? You know, while keeping innocence and while keeping benevolence inside. So, that, this one is a little bit difficult. I always find this one difficult because courtesy and benevolence, for me, are almost the same thing. It's very difficult to decide between the two. So public spiritedness is benevolent, you know, with other people, but the same as diplomaticness, you know, like, you know, good breeding. It's like they're, they're so close that they're almost the same, but there's definitely a difference there. There is a difference, but it's an overlap, I think. So I hope you enjoyed that.